Mm-hmm. Here goes nothing. What's here? Oh, grown up at last. Thinking the place was staffed by fetuses. Ask how to come in. Well, I'm afraid you've got me. What seems to be the trouble? Uh, Mrs. Fallon fainted. I didn't faint. I tripped. And was brought in by a passerby. Right. She's been experiencing shortness of breath. I've done a BM, a full set of OBS and an ECG. Good. OK. Normally fitting well? As a butcher's dog. <laughs> I really need to get going. <laughs> OK. Should we have a listen first? I can ask Carol or Ethan. There's no need. Thank you. Sorry. But don't apologise. Like dealing with a spaniel puppy. You can train a spaniel. It's a wonder you're not driven mad. <laughs> HDC? Men? Speaking me out. Well, he's probably just trying to make an effort. Well, has he made an effort with you? No. Alicia Munro, F2, nurses. Hi, Alicia. Really nice to meet yeah. you. Uh, I'm Robin. This is Lofty. Yeah, I brought cake. It's in the staff room. Just help yourself. Cake? You can stay. <laughs> is it Vicky Sponge? Oh, no, no, it was it's an Mm. Yeah, a special blend of your lang, your lang and lavender. It's great for stress. That's very kind. Thank you. Oh, and we could do some Reiki as well, right? It's very healing. Yeah, well, who needs peer review? Yeah, you know, count me on that. Eh? All booked. What is? I then the links with me and Ethan. Golfing. Oh, brilliant. Uh, I'll try not to embarrass you. Just, just wanted to show him he's, he's part of the family now. Our family. Thanks, Dad. Hey, we can do that Reiki tomorrow as well, if you like. Reiki? Isn't that...? It's healing hands, yeah, yeah. So is there something I can help you with? Mrs. Fallon's old notes. Oh, right, OK. Would you be so kind? Thanks. Ah, OK, right. Uh, will you take some mobs? I'll be there straight away. Oh, taxi! Please, Mrs. Fallon, I need you to come back inside. You've done all your little tests. I need to get home. Bill's on his own. Your husband? Dog. We're not all soft in the head. Husband, I can't think of anything worse. All that ego massaging and pastry making. <laughs> I'm sorry, I... Mrs. Fallon, we know about your diagnosis. Hmm? Why didn't you tell us? I knew this would happen, all this fuss. Uh... I really have to go. Oh. You're right. Now. We need to investigate the shortness of breath that you're having. It's just a wheeze. Why don't you come inside with us? Come on. Yeah. Uh. Uh. So if not alone, could you extend my overdraft? Yeah, I'm on temp contract. Loved it, mate. You two doing all right? Yeah, I think so. Uh, weirdly, he's actually been quite nice. <laughs> it shows a substantial amount of fluid in your chest cavity. That's putting pressure on your lungs. That's why you're struggling to breathe. Is it the cancer? Please, Dr. Keogh. Has it spread? It's very likely, yes. Given your diagnosis, stage 4B, endometrioid cancer, yeah. Right. So when can I go home? Well, we don't know just yet. We're going to drain the fluid here. That'll help with the breathing. And then we'll admit you, OK? When you're done, Lofty. We'll need to do an ultrasound-guided percutaneous drain, OK? Lily? 